Hi, I'm Mike Murphy, and welcome to The Short, the news roundup from IBM Research. First up, measuring the impact of AI agents for IT. The generative AI explosion has been astounding to witness, but when it comes to bringing these revolutionary tools to the world of work, adoption has been pretty limited. Right now, it's difficult to compare how efficient these AI systems are for reliably solving business problems, because tests to show their efficacy don't really exist. And that inspired IBM Research to create IT Bench, it's a series of benchmarks to test how good agents are at solving actual tasks that businesses carry out every day. At the start, there'll be three benchmarks focused on site reliability engineering, FinOps cost management, and compliance assessments. You can try these benchmarks out on GitHub right now. Next, upending decades of chip architecture for AI. Back in 1945, John von Neumann and his colleagues had an idea for a stored program computer. In a paper, von Neumann described a computer with a processing unit, control unit, memory that stored data and instructions, external storage, and input-output mechanisms. If that sounds familiar, that's because it's more or less been the basis of every computer since then. Known as the von Neumann architecture, this structure has been great for conventional computing. But for AI workloads, it's a different story. AI operations are simple, numerous, and highly predictable. A conventional processor ends up working below its full capacity while it waits for model weights to be shuttled back and forth from memory, a lag that's commonly called the von Neumann bottleneck. Researchers at IBM are working on new processors like the AIU family that break down that bottleneck and build chips that could supercharge AI computing. And finally, the 2024 IBM Research Annual Letter is here. This year's letter is a detailed dive into 2024's major breakthroughs in AI, quantum computing, semiconductors, and fundamental science. And as we look ahead, 2025 also happens to be the 80th anniversary of IBM Research's founding. In the letter, we explored our earliest days and how they set us up for so many decades of innovation. But equally important is where we're going next. The breakthroughs ahead, our vision for the future of computing, and the impact on communities around the world. I encourage you to grab your favorite beverage and spend some time with the letter as we prepare for the next 80 years of innovation and beyond. For more on the latest innovations from IBM, make sure you subscribe to our newsletter, Future Forward. Till next time.